How's it going, folks? A little admin before we start off the episode here. Between the last time recording and now, there's been a new patch released, version 1.13 for PS4. Now, as you may know, I've been doing this playthrough with the majority of the HUD turned off. The only HUD elements I've been using are the energy bar and the ability shortcuts, and even they are set to turn off after a set interval. Unfortunately, there's a bit of a bug with this update, whereby reticles appear for weapons, and while you're in cover, even if you have that HUD element disabled. It's not game-breaking by any stretch, but it is annoying for me, and anyone else for that matter, who enjoy doing no HUD runs. Anyway, that's it. Thought I'd just bring it up, seeing as you're going to start seeing reticles for the remainder of the playthrough. Hopefully, another patch will fix this. Now, let's get on with it. The front way is closed, we'll have to use this side entrance. More social commentary there, not to say it isn't effective in the point it's trying to make, but much like the natural only benches, it's just a bit too on the nose. It's not really drawing a parallel, it's more like it's just mimicking the atrocities of our real world history without any thought for applicability. Nothing's more private than my info link. I'm not so sure. I've sent a secure vid call number to your smart home system. Get to your apartment and call me. Verify. Alara, what are you doing here? Is that going to become our standard conversation starter? I'm serious, Delara. It's dangerous outside. Non-essential staff should be home. How did you even get- Ouch. Non-essential. I just meant- Work with me, Adam. I was trying for a little levity. Truth is, watching Pikus News, hearing that the mobs were getting closer to the city, I was reminded of- Let's just say I thought being three stories below ground was better than staying in my apartment. So... I called in a favor and got state police to escort me in. Listen, I can tell something big is happening, so I don't want to keep you. Last time we spoke to her, she couldn't wait to get away from us. Now she's starting a conversation. Just what's going on with her? You doing okay, Delara? Look, Adam, I didn't tell you why I left Lim International. That I was in session with a patient when the incident hit, and that I was... You were attacked. Her name was Madeline. She was 13. A really sweet kid. One minute we were talking, laughing actually, about something silly I'd said, and the next she was... She, God, Adam, I could see in her eyes that some part of her was still in there, locked away. And she was terrified. Delara, I'm sure the girl... Madeline. Her name was Madeline. You know the part that I'll never forget, though? The thing that keeps... Just replaying in my mind over and over. Right before she jumped out of my office window, I could swear she was crying. It's a tragic story, but it's completely out of the blue. I mean, where is this coming from? Why is she telling us this? 
Empathy is what she needs, I guess. She's not alone in this. Believe me, Delara, I know how you feel. You know what I think? I think we're stronger than that day. I think the scars we carry are like armor now. Like armor? Hmm, I like that. Guess I just got a little spooked, you know? I understand. But regardless of the reason you took a risk coming back here, these are dangerous times for everyone. You don't need to worry about me, Adam. I'll be fine. I'll just hunker down in my office until the storm passes. Besides, I hear I have a very comfortable couch. Just take care of yourself. I always do. You dig deep enough with these guys, you start to find us together. Hey, Adam. How'd you get here? I thought the city was locked down. It's like a war zone out there. I was just cleared for active duty. I don't want anything to mess that up. I'll wait out the storm in here. Whose unit are you assigned to for your next mission? Macready's. Really? I thought... He actually recommended me. Told me I shoot better than anyone on his team. That's great. Talk to you later, Aria. Bye, Adam. See you out there. So Arya might get to see some action after all. Let's drop in on some of the other task force members while we're here. I've got three separate reports. Smiley, hanging in there? Me? Hmm. What about you? After your little recon mission, you come back to guns in the street. It's pretty bad out there. Any trouble getting around? Well, nothing I couldn't handle. Well, at least you're positive. Wish I was right now. I've been combing through Dr. Talis Rucker's autopsy report, and apparently the medical examiner found nothing. Can you believe that? Nothing. No poison, no bacteria or toxin of any kind was found in his system. Officially, the cause of death was inconclusive. Inconclusive? I watched him die, and I know for a fact Marchenko did it. They must have found something. That's just what I thought, so I got my hands on an earlier draft of the report. And while they were unsure of the cause, at least they knew the effect. An unidentified foreign agent started attacking protein strands, bending them out of shape. The effect propagated throughout the body, made its way to the brain, where it was game over. Do not pass go, do not collect 200 credits. And that speculation, as they called it, is not in the final coroner's report. As far as they're concerned, the case is closed. But not for you, right? There's an unknown substance that kills people in minutes. I want to know what it is. I'm gonna find out. They've already blocked my request once, but I spoke to Miller and he told me Manderley would make a few calls and get things moving. Okay, stick with it. Don't worry about that. It'll take more than being stonewalled by state police to stop me. I'll let you know if anything else comes up. Well, that pretty much confirms that someone up top is suppressing information. Not that that wasn't already obvious to us. Let's see what Chang has to say for himself. Not safe out there. Not safe anywhere. You know, I was starting to think you got rounded up. My god, martial law! I... I heard it's pretty bad out there. Bad enough. Don't go out if you don't have to. Yeah, well, it's getting bad in here too. I've been going a little nuts. I mean, to tell you the truth, I'm not even sure who I can trust anymore. What are you talking about, Chang? You know I've been looking into Janus, right? Well, turns out Janus knows things about this place. About us. Things they could only know if... It... Information that could only come from inside. You think Janus has a mole inside the task force? What makes you say that? What exactly have you found? I... I can't tell you that, Jensen. Not because I don't trust you. You're one of the few people I do trust. I just... I don't know who might be listening. All right. What have you told Miller? Nothing yet. I'm still piecing things together. I told you because... well, because I had to tell someone. Thanks for the heads up, Chang. Yeah, thanks for the heads up. Too bad the only guy you've told is the mole you're trying to avoid, so... Good job. Finally, let's go see Miller. I understand that. But I have agents scattered if around this city. My exclusive interview with Brown. Log on to That's what I'm trying to tell you. This is Eliza Kassar, reporting to you live danger. from Pikes. Exactly. How the hell are my people supposed to do their jobs if your people keep arresting them? 
Do you want more people to die? You made it. Hell of a time for a lockdown. More like convenient, given everything that's happened in this investigation so far. What does that mean? They knew I was coming. Marchenko and the gold mask from Dubai. Somebody tipped them off. Are you accusing me? I'm not accusing anyone, yet. But two ambushes in less than a month? I want to know what's really going on. So do I. McCready dug into Garm. Started out as a geological research center, funded by the European Union until 2025, when it was purchased by a nameless shell company. You put Chang on it? That kid scares me. Tracked it back to Bell Tower Associates in under an hour. I take it no one purchased it when Bell Tower went bankrupt last year. Wasn't even listed on the asset sheet. So like I said, you stumbled into something big. Care to focus on figuring out what it is? Right after you contacted me, I got on the horn with Leon. Had them send in a strike team from France. It got there about an hour after you two slipped out. And the mercs were gone. We have no idea where they went or what they're planning next. Not necessarily. I heard Marchenko talking to his men. He said something about finalizing a deal with the Diwali. We need to move on this now. I'll get a search warrant for that old Diwali owned theater on Zar Dibi Adlam Street. You really think we have time for a search warrant? No. But with the city under lockdown, I can't guarantee you'll make it over to the Red Light District alive. I got here, didn't I? Nobody's killed me yet. All right, fine. I won't stop you. Just be careful out there, Jensen. Let me know what you find. Got me that. The Red Light District is on the other side of the city. Instead of sneaking all the way over there, we'll use the metro tunnels to bypass the majority of the blockades. If we follow the metro tunnels via the Precasca district, we can call into Adam's apartment to have that chat with Sarif. What happened there? Did the Tesla Org disable that camera? So it can be used to temporarily stun cameras, that's good to know. Another tool in the toolbox I suppose. I wonder if the walker gears we've seen walking around are susceptible to it too. 